Today's deadly bridge accident down south of us on Interstate 35 brings really more meaning to National Work Zone Awareness Week. Yeah, the accident in Bell County happened in a spot where TxDOT was working on a bridge. DPS says 87% of people killed in construction zones last year were motorists, not construction workers. Fox Force James Rose has more in tonight's Street Squad. 19,000 crashes across the state in work zones last year. Those are huge numbers. Crashes like this one on I-35 in Dallas nearly two weeks ago. Just before midnight, police say the driver of an SUV lost control near Royal Lane and crashed right through this construction site. The SUV ended up hanging over a bridge. The driver was hospitalized and no workers were injured. Traffic patterns in construction zones can change overnight. TxDOT, the NTTA, and construction companies are doing what they can to make workers safer by wearing bright reflective clothing, protecting the work area with concrete barriers, and they now have this device. This time-lapse NTTA video shows how quickly and safely workers can set up and move this mobile protection zone while working in traffic. Just about anywhere you go in North Texas, you'll run into construction zones. Last year, DPS says 146 people were killed in construction zones, and that, they say, is up 20% from the year before. The two major reasons, speed and driver distraction. I believe it to be true. AAA this week released a study saying nearly 60% of all teen crashes involve distractions. But as you'll see in this video, it's not just teens. Well, that's what you get, dude. This driver was so interested in screaming obscenities at our Fox 4 photographer, he failed to maintain control of his vehicle. Even though that law about slow down moved over past two years ago, I still routinely run into folks that say I didn't know that. Some drivers we talked to knew the law almost verbatim, but it doesn't hurt to remind people. You're either supposed to switch lanes or slow down to 20 miles or below the speed limit. You actually to get over in another lane so that you won't hurt or hit somebody and also slow down. James Rose, Fox 4 News, Street Squad.